Matson Personal Grower, Senior Faculty Member at Informatson Corsica. Now, dear students, as you all know, Punjab University NC2021 is coming very nearby. And abhi tak to aap logon ki sabki tiyari complete ho chuki hogi. You might have completed your whole of the syllabus and obviously aapne maximum mock test aur apni preparations ko check kar liya hoga ki how is your preparations. Now, basically, this is the main video which we are putting up for you people how to handle the last minute pressure. Obviously, sab pressure mein hoi kar morning mein Punjab University ka exam hai aur kis tarah se hume dena hai. So today, we will be discussing about this last minute preparations. Aapko kya karna chahiye, kya nahi karna chahiye, paper kaisa aayega, kis level ka paper aayega aur aapko kis tarah se usko evaluate aur kis tarah se us paper ko handle karna chahiye. Kyunki ek bhoat different cheez hai ki paper prepare karna aur ek bhoat different cheez hai wahaan jaake paper ko manage karna, paper ko handle karna. So today we will be telling you how to manage that paper, how to handle that paper which you will be giving tomorrow. Right? So let's start with the presentation. So now students, PUMC entrance do's and don'ts. Obviously the presentation is given to you by Infomats and that is a last minute preparations, a guidance to you all, how to prepare, how to handle the last minute pressure in the paper and before the paper. It's very important and definitely you should follow these instructions for having a very good productivity in your paper. So firstly, let's discuss about don'ts, right? What you should not do before the paper or what should you not do in the paper. No new topics. Kabhi bhi niya chapter pick mat kiji. No new topics, new chapter. Jitna aapka preparation hai, it is good. Believe in yourself that what you have done is good. Right? So no new topics, no new chapter in the last minute. Try to avoid this thing. No discussion of the PVU preparation with friends or any person. Ya teri kitni preparation hai. It is just a sort ki aap apne aap aur pressure me leke aongi. So jitna aapne kiya, you have done your best. Aapne pura time aapna diya hai. Aapne best de ji hai. So fight till the paper, but uske baad aap kuch nahi kar sakte ho, right? So no discussion of the PU papers with the friends or any person. Don't think about your weakness. Kabhi mat socho ki ye mera weak topic hai yaar, isme se kuch aa gaya to. Always think about your strong points, ki isme se questions aayenge to yes, I can do it. Weak topics or weakness ke baare mein kabhi sochiye bhi mat. Ki wo aapko khiche ho yaar, wo ek, andar se aapko ek kahe ga ki yes, agar isme se questions aa gaya to mera questions galat ho jayenge. So jitna aapne prepare kiya hai, have confidence in you. Don't think that he has prepared what he has prepared, how much preparation is, how much preparation is, how much preparation is, then he will be more intelligent than he will be more preparation. So leave everything of these sort of thoughts in your mind. Don't estimate your preparation and overestimate others' preparation. So don't underestimate yourself and don't overestimate yourself. That is the best thing. And don't visit any Facebook groups, WhatsApp, Telegram groups. Obviously, these groups will divert you somewhere and divert your mind. So, keep your mind on your mind. So, keep your trust on your mind. Facebook, WhatsApp, Telegram channels, stop them. Keep your mind on your mind so that you can give a good level of your exam. Now, let's study what you should do before the examination. What you should do before the examination. Have confidence in yourself. Keep your mind very calm. Concentrate upon your strengths. What you have prepared, concentrate upon that part. In fact, of thinking कि दूसरे ने क्या किया. Think of worst. अपने आप को एक उस situation में लेके जाइए कि अगर ऐसे नहीं होगा तो क्या होगा, right? Still you have, you will be same. Still you will be the best. Still we, you will be the best son, your best daughter, your best friend. So nothing life is never changed if something is not achieved. जब आप negative लेके चलेंगे तो कुछ positive ही होगा. जितना करोगे वो positive ही करोगे. So be cool. So one good or one bad day can't decide your life, right? It's a very simple thing. One good or one bad day can, not, can never decide your life. Lastly, speed more or more time with your, spend more and more time with your parents, family, friends and have fun with them. And use, express your feelings and don't feel like you have a lot of tense day. It's just a paper, right? It's just a paper. Kuch do gante mein bigad nahi jayega. So have confidence in you. Listen to music, play your favorite game. So keep yourself relaxed before the examination so that you can give a good level for the exam. So apply this do's and definitely you will find the difference that your paper will be good. Because you are having full confidence in you that what you have prepared, you have prepared very well prepared. So let's see the scheme of the paper. What kind of paper will come tomorrow? It will be 1 hour 30 minutes paper total and of 75 questions. 
and then 75 questions will be divided into four parts A, B, C, D. Part A will compose comprises of mathematics that will be of 10 plus 1 plus 2 level questions of mathematics of 40 marks. Computer science of 15 marks, English 10 or reasoning and arithmetic 10. So this is the scheme of the paper. Ki kis tarah se aapko 75 marks equally divide hoonge four parts mein. So don't think ki aapko bhoat hi tough level aapka paper aapka because PU ka the paper and that is a simple level of paper. It is not on a very high rate. Uh, grades like IIT or IIT's ke questions aenge, advanced questions aenge, means ke. Agar aapne ek fundamental course hi bhoat achhi tarah kiya hai, you can attempt the paper in a very good way. So obviously have confidence in yourself and your preparation. Reasoning quant for computers, you all know that is the basic fundamentals of computers is there. Just simple questions of English will be asked. So basically, PU ka paper is a very basic level pe paper. Ja hai. So you should have confidence in yourself that what you have done is the best. So don't worry about it, you will do the best in your paper. And now we will discuss what are the strategies you should follow during the paper. So always, this is the main slide which I am going to explain you. Always apply S cube technique. Always apply S cube technique during the paper. So what is this S cube technique is scan, search and solve. When you are given a paper of 75 questions, don't start from question number 1. 1 pada, kya pata mushkil ho, dar jayin, right? Agla padne ki himmat hi na ho, ya we feel like yes, kuch bhi nahi aata yaar, itni dir padhe, right? So, एक एक करके क्वेश्चन मत पढ़िए हो सकता है इसमें से ऐसे क्वेश्चंस भी हो पेपर में जो आपके अनटचड रह जाएं और बाद में जब आपके पास आए तो वो आपके पास टाइम बहुत कम हो तभी मैंने बोला स्कैन 20 टू 30% पेपर तो आपको यानी कि अगर आप पीयू का देखो तो आई वुड से कि 40% पेपर आपको इजी लेवल पे आएगा 40 to 50% पेपर राइट 20% पेपर आपको एवरेज आएगा एंड 20 30% पेपर आपको टफेस्ट लेवल पे आएगा राइट सो बेसिकली जब आप उसको स्कैन करेंगे यानी कि हैव अ लुक एट अ थोरो पेपर ऑफ 75 क्वेश्चंस काफी क्वेश्चन तो वो टिक मार्क्स टिक मार्क्स टिक मार्क कर रहे हैं जहां से जैसे आपने असाइनमेंट पूरी की है राइट लेवल 1 लेवल 2 असाइनमेंट्स पूरी की हैं आपने तो उसी में से क्वेश्चंस आ जाएंगे आपके प्रीवियस ईयर्स पेपर्स अगर आपने किए हैं 20 इयर्स के उसी में से क्वेश्चंस रिपीटेड होंगे राइट तो वो क्वेश्चन तो डायरेक्ट मार्क हो गए आपके और उसमें गलत होने का चांस ही नहीं बिकॉज़ वो आप घर से करके आए हैं प्रीवियस ईयर पेपर्स असाइनमेंट लेवल्स वर्कशीट्स लेवल्स वो सब आप कर चुके हैं सो वो आपका स्कैनिंग में जाएगा जब जो बच गया उसमें से सर्च कीजिए कि सबसे पहले आपको कौन सा इजी लगता है स्टार्ट सॉल्विंग कि वो जल्दी निकल जाएगा एंड देन सॉल्व द क्वेश्चंस सो अकॉर्डिंग टू योर स्ट्रेंथ यू विल सिलेक्ट द क्वेश्चंस व्हिच यू कैन डू वेरी इजीली यूज पेंसिल और रबर फॉर अ रफ वर्क नॉट अ पेन बिकॉज़ अगर आप कहीं पे रफ वर्क करते से आपने क्वेश्चन नंबर 21 सॉल्व किया कि ये आपको गलती होगी या अगर आपको एक ही शीट मिली है राइट right? उसके बाद आपको शीट नहीं मिली है तो ये क्वेश्चन आपका सॉल्व हो गया तो उसको रब करके यहां पे क्वेश्चन नंबर 22 भी कर सकते हैं आप राइट right? Always make triangles so that आप अगर by chance आपने question number thirteen किया है वो आप बीच में रुक गया आपका, right? आपने उसको सोचा कि मैं बाद में आके करूँगा। So take a pause इस thirteen question को यही रहने दीजिए और उसके बाद आगे चलिए। जब आप वापस आएंगे आधा question आपने किया हुआ होगा वापस आके अगर आपका mind fresh है तो ये आप कर सकते हैं। So आपका आधा time बच जाएगा। So अपनी पूरी sheet को छोटे-छोटे rectangles में divide कीजिए और हर एक question को उस rectangles में कीजिए। जो क्वेश्चन हो जाए उसको उसी टाइम रब कर दीजिए उस जगह नया क्वेश्चन कर लीजिए सो दैट विल सेव अ लॉट ऑफ टाइम फॉर यू राइट सो दिस इज हाउ यू कैन अटेम्प्ट द पेपर बाय एस क्यूब टेक्निक दिस इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टेक्निक व्हिच वी यूजुअली फॉर आस्क आवर स्टूडेंट्स टू फॉलो इन द एग्जामिनेशन दैट इज एस क्यूब टेक्निक स्कैन सर्च एंड सॉल्व एंड डेफिनेटली इट गिव्स यू वेरी गुड रिजल्ट्स सो द स्टूडेंट्स नाउ जस्ट रिलैक्स सिट बैक एट योर होम प्लेस एंड जस्ट थिंक दैट यू हैव प्रिपेयर्ड वेल फॉर द एग्जामिनेशन Always think about your positives, not your negatives. कुछ भी नहीं होता, दो घंटे का एक सिंपल एग्जामिनेशन है, and obviously negative marking is there in Punjab University paper, right? अगर आपको थोड़ा सा भी एक doubt है कि क्वेश्चन गलत है, या मेरा आंसर गलत निकल रहा है, don't attempt the paper, don't attempt that question, leave that question, आगे चलिए, right? और try to attempt those questions which you are having hundred percent surety, yes, you can do it. क्योंकि हर साल अगर हम कट ऑफ की बात करेंगे तो पीयू की कट ऑफ हर साल डिफरेंट रहती है डिपेंडिंग अपॉन द लेवल ऑफ द कॉम्प्लेक्सिटी ऑफ द पेपर अगर पेपर बहुत सिंपल लेवल पे है तो कट ऑफ 55 60 मार्क्स तक भी जाती है और अगर पेपर बहुत टफ लेवल पे है तो 40 मार्क्स तक भी कट ऑफ जाती है और कभी-कभी तो ऐसा होता है कि एक 20 मार्क्स वाले बच्चे को भी एडमिशन मिल जाता है पीयू में बिकॉज़ लेवल ऑफ द पेपर बहुत टफ होता है राइट बट अब कल जैसा पेपर आएगा आपको इट डिपेंड्स अपॉन कि उसका उसका 
complexity level kya hoga so we will be again discussing after the examination again on youtube channel informats india we will putting up the analysis of the pe paper ki paper kaisa tha most probably kind of jaane kya chances hain so always be with us subscribe to our youtube channel informats india for the regular video channels so that you should be regular boosted up for your further next upcoming examinations of mc entrance so till then all the best in your pe paper all the best